Now let's solve a uh, prism. Let's solve a pentagonal prism. Let's solve a regular pentagonal prism. Regular tells us that all the sides of the pentagon are the same. So, six, 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 six. Okay? So, surface area, account for all the surfaces. We have two hexes. And we have five rectangles. Well, rectangles are pretty easy. They're 15 by 6. Which is what? Uh, not five. Yeah, 15 by 6. Each one's 15 by 6. That's 90. And we have five of them. Because they're five sides. One, two... Three, four, five. That one in the, in the back top there. Okay. So they're five. So 450. Just for the sides. Now we got a hex. We got to solve a hex. We got to find the area of a hex. So we got to solve a hexagon. Well, solve a hexagon. It's got a side of six. All the sides are six. Well, the easiest way. And it's nice that it's regular, is we can break it up into five equal triangles and solve the triangle. Which means we need to find the height of the triangle. And you all went together, okay? I missed a little bit, didn't I? So we need to find the height of this triangle. It's going to the center. That's what we got to solve. Well, we know that, again, we know this side is 6, but we got to find that, that red line, that height. Well, trig is going to let us do that. So let's break out, bust out some trig. So we've got, we're going to cut the tri the, that big triangle in half. Um, that angle. Well, because it's five equal triangles, that angle is 72. 360 divided by 5, which makes that angle 36. We need to find that. Well, sine, cosine, tangent, so katoa. We have, we're standing here, 3 is opposite, and the H is adjacent, so tangent. So tangent. 36 equals opposite 3 over H. Cross multiply, flip, solve, whichever way you know how to solve. So we're going to go H tangent 36 equals 3. Divide both sides by tan 36. H equals 3 divided by tan 36. And we will find that H equals. I don't know yet because I haven't done it. 3 divided by tangent of 36. 4.13. Awesome. We know the height. So now we know that this is 4.13. So that triangle, the area of that triangle, one half base times height equals one half times six. I like parentheses better. Uh, times four point one three. So one half times six times four point one three equals twelve point three nine. That's not a nine. Twelve point three nine. All right, that solves us that. There are five of those. So multiply that by five. 61.95 centimeters squared. That is the hex. You got to use some trig. You got to use some trig to solve your hex. Because it's regular, we're going to be able to bisect things. That's nice. 
If it's not regular, you just gotta bust it up in the shapes you can find. So sixty one ninety five. So hexes sixty one point ninety five for each hex. So I gotta add. So our surface area is five rectangles, which we've solved right there four fifty, plus a hex, plus another hex. Plus 450, 573.9 centimeters squared. We accounted for all the surfaces. That 450 accounted for all five rectangles. 6195 and 6195 accounted for both bases.